Hi, I'm Robert Soler, and I'm going to talk about the Icarus TI2. So the TI2 on the surface, 685 watts input, 2.5 micromoles per joule, and an IP66 uh, wet rating, which basically means that this thing is designed to weather um, anything you throw at it. Any water, it's not going to get inside. Additionally, what we've done here is we made it a cleanable lens. Um, so it's a glass lens. That's actually really important that it's glass and not plastic. Uh, because UV will degrade, um, in greenhouse applications, UV will degrade plastics, um, but it will not degrade glass. So it's important that we use glass here. Um, one of the things that makes this really um, ideal for a greenhouse application is our unique thermal design. And I'll show that to you. So what we have is what looks like a hollow uh, heat sink, but actually it's an active heat um, cooling mechanism, uh, a heat pipe basically that goes up the sides of this. And what that allows us to do, this is a technique that's used in supercomputers, uh, but never has been before used in horticulture lighting. But what that allows us to do is create a, a highly concentrated light source in a very small footprint. And so, why that's important is because in a greenhouse application, what you want to do is supplement the sun. You don't want to have something that shades the sun and blocks your, your free source of light. So, um, so it's all designed to keep that, that profile tight um, and keep it from casting too much of a shadow. An additional feature of the TI2 is a remote power supply. Um, this is it right here. So this box um, can sit off, off the actual fixture itself allowing you to distribute the weight differently so you're not putting all the weight here on your, on your main uh, member. Um, also, this thing is fully dimmable, dim to off cap capabilities. So you have full dim, dimming range, um, high output, you can see here. And then as you dim it down, as you dim all the way down, it goes to off. Um, so the ability to, um, to turn it on and off with just the dimming interface, that's actually a really big deal. Um, because a lot of these power supplies um, have a lot of what's called inrush current. So when you turn them all on together, it actually creates a lot of current um, coming through the system and actually could cause some issues with your, with your contactors and your switches. So it's really important to kind of have this kind of mechanism because it eliminates that inrush current. And finally, we're going to talk about spectrum. So BIOS lighting um, incorporates specific LEDs. Um, if you see this array here, that, um, that incorporates the, um, these high efficiency red LEDs that promote photosynthetic efficiency. And we blend that with these white LEDs that are utilized in architectural grade lighting fixtures uh, for human vision. And this balance um, combines the best of what's important for plants and important for human vision all into one system that is the most photosynthetically efficient white light you could possibly get. So in summary, what we're showing here is the Icarus TI2 is, has the minimal form factor, energy efficient solution, um, highest efficacy white light product, um, cleanable lens uh, that you can see here made of glass, IP66 rated to weather any conditions that you have. It's industrial grade, it's durable, and all the things that we put together is what makes BIOS naturally brilliant.